Hello Internet Land, Josh Creason here from 4X Bootcamp, a community of people, a team gathered together learning to be successful traders on the foreign exchange. Anyway, tonight's thought, um, uh, an attitude of gratitude. You saw the title there probably before you clicked on this thing. An attitude of gratitude. I've just been meditating on gratitude all day. You know, um, it's such an important outlook to have on life in general. Um, you know, I don't know if you know anybody that is that does not have an attitude of gratitude, but man, after a while it starts to stand out, doesn't it? You start to notice like, man, that person always tends to be a little negative and you're like, what could possibly be so bad that you could be that negative about it all the time? You always got to find something wrong with everything. You know, if it's food, you don't like it. If it's if it's a person, you're complaining something about them. Um it's just constant negativity from some people, but you gotta, you know, I guess that's part of uh, the way this world kind of flows on its own. It's easy to get caught up in that, but you really gotta cultivate an attitude of gratitude and pause and take time to be thankful. Um, I mean, we all have stuff to be thankful for. If you, if you have the internet and you have a phone or a computer, you're sitting here watching me right now on Facebook or YouTube, wherever you're watching this, um, trust me, you have things to be grateful for. If you have enough money to have a smartphone or an internet or internet service, Hey, you're probably not doing too bad. Even if, uh, even the homeless people in America, you you can go to the library and get on the internet. You're already like better off than most of the world, right there, because um, you have access to resources to change your life. Uh, anything is possible here, right? I mean, maybe you're not watching this in America. Maybe you're in Africa. I've been in Africa. I love Africa. It has its challenges, but you know what? Maybe you have a family that loves you. Maybe you don't. Maybe you have one good friend. Um, Maybe you don't have any friends, but you've got your health. And you say, maybe I don't have my health, but I have friends. You know, there's there's always something to be grateful for, right? If you have a uh, thinking capacity to, to sit around and think about what you can or can't be grateful for, hey, at least your mind is operating, right? You've got a mind. You can use it. And that's a blessing, right? Count your blessings. There's so many blessings, right? I've, I've had this song going through my, my head, two songs actually, in, in thinking about gratitude. And one was... Uh, Bob Marley, give thanks and praises, right? Some of you may or may not believe in, in God or a deity or, or a person to focus your gratitude on, but you can still maintain an attitude of gratitude, just thankfulness for the many blessings that we enjoy. And um, the other song was uh, Natalie Merchant. I don't know if you remember that song. I want to thank you, thank you. Hey, is there someone in your life that you can thank today? Someone that's poured into you? Someone that's been a blessing to you? Your parents? Give them a call, you know? Were they good to you? Maybe they weren't the greatest parents, but hey, maybe they put a roof over your head. Maybe they put clothes on your back. Maybe they put food in your mouth. Um, I'm sure they did the best they could. Some of our parents, you know, weren't so amazing, but, you know, they did the best they could most of the time, right? There's something to be thankful for. Maybe you have a job. You can thank your boss. Hey, you know what? I, You know, a lot of people complain about their job, but I just want you to know that I appreciate the fact that you've created a company here and a place for me to work. Um, just cultivate that attitude of gratitude. What can you be thankful for today? We don't think about that enough. I mean, the day of Thanksgiving comes around once a year, and you know, you all end up at that table, around that table with someone, and someone has always got to say, hey, can we go around the table and everyone just say something that they're thankful for? And you're forced in that moment to think of, hey, there's got to be at least one thing <laughs> that I'm thankful for because you don't want to come across as whiny McWhinerson, negative Nelly, right? You, you got to think of something, you know, it's your friends, it's your family, it's the fact that you're there eating some turkey and gravy, whatever it is. Hey, but why do we got to do that only once a year? We can do that all year long, every day. Focus on something that you can be grateful for. I'm grateful for you guys watching. Kathy, Jason, Tom. Um, I just saw John there a minute ago. Thank you guys for watching. Hey, I hope this has been a blessing to you. I'm sorry, those of you that just now clicked on. I, I think it was pretty encouraging to maintain an attitude of gratitude. And uh, so if, if you want to go back and rewatch it real quick, that's awesome. If you have any comments or questions, you want to encourage me, um, leave some comments. If you think this would be a great message to share on your timeline, please do. Thanks for your time. Love you guys. Talk to you later.